back to Gary Grigsby's War in the East, the play-by-email campaign that I'm uh, doing with Agrippa Maxentius and XTRG. And both of those guys have gone. They've taken their turn, and now it's our turn to continue. I'm not sure. We're so, oh, we're in air mode, right? I'm like, what the heck is this? Uh, let's see. It's turn three. We have to. Um, we have to let the Soviets do their thing, and I think we will right now. So we're gonna have to see what the Soviets do. End this turn. Y well, are we sure? Yes, we're sure. We are quite sure. Yeah, they're uh, definitely. Um, Digging in near Peshkov and Velikiliki and Mogilev, Vitebsk, Smolensk is nearly gone. Oh, okay, they've um, dropped supplies apparently in an attempt to uh, hold out. That's fine, they can waste that. Uh, many of these units are stuck behind lines and I suspect. It will stay that way for quite some time. All right, here we go. Got some movement in the swamps. Apparently they're. Oh wow! Okay, they're being uh, really pushy here in the uh, south near Odessa. Agrippa's forces, but they held the second time round. Okay, good, good. And they're gonna attack again. They held again. Wow. Okay, these Russians really want to push him back, but uh, so far no luck. More supplies being dropped. It's uh, near Smolensk there. To the west of Smolensk. So yeah, they're really trying to hold out in these little pockets by dropping supplies. Um, they're not losing any fighters, which is worrying. Apparently... Yeah. Apparently they still have that option. That's fine. All these supplies are going to fall into our hands, <laughs> which is which is fine, you know. That's all right. And they actually lost some bombers there. Okay, good. The more they lose. Here we are. One bomber lost. This is interesting. I, the AI is really trying to get these pockets supplied. It's it's not much, but it counts. It's actually quite smart. Uh, I mean, as long as these pockets are there, they're they're in our way. We really, we, we can't ignore them. Well, XTRG has sort of said, well, we're going to ignore them. But look, they're even dropping stuff into Smolensk. Quite a few, like 13 tons of, of supplies of 25 needed. 14, there we go. These guys are, they're chock full of supplies now. They're going to, they're going to feed. They're going to, um, uh, they're going to ammo up. And really, their, their their morale will go up, which is a problem. Look, even these guys back here are uh, getting supplied now. Is this a counterattack coming in July? That would be really extreme. I'm not quite sure what's going on here. Yeah, lots of movement in the south here. And that's our turn. Okay, that's all we get. That's all she wrote. Okay. Wow, that's that was interesting. An air campaign to to supply uh, troops. Didn't expect that, but uh, that's the way it is. This rail line is still open. That's a problem. I would close that down as quickly as possible, uh, Grippa. If you want these troops not to be supplied. Okay. If anyone wants to see these uh, statistics, just feel free to pause the video for a second. Um, Let's see, how well are we doing? We've inflicted half a million losses, but we took quite a few losses ourselves. Um, yeah, bit of a problem there. Um, a th 100,000 roughly, and they lost half a million, which is still not enough. They have millions more, and we only have a few million, like three or four million men, I think, at this point in the war uh, on this front. Alright, doesn't matter that much right now, but it could become a theory if you... Alright, let's see. So, I've got these guys. 
uh, Armor Group North 13th Corps. That's these guys. Who are right on top of their, um, their troops there. And it's this tank division just sort of sitting in our way. Uh, they have a shit ton of AT. Let's use that, shall we? What kind of opposition are we facing? Mm, well, actually quite strong opposition in comparison. We've only got 14 attack. Is that right? Is that our attack power? I always forget. Let's see what happens if we... Uh, no, is that... Yeah, let's do both of them. And see if we can kick this guy in a, out of our way here. He helped. All right. Hmm. Well, maybe we should try cutting them off. That might work. Let's just use one. Keep these guys occupied, as they say. There we go. Nothing coming in through the rails now. Anything anything more belongs belonging to us? No, that's that's it. Alright, well, they're all in supply. They're gonna hold this tank division in place for a while. Until we can cut it off. Let's see. Vilnius still ours, but there's a few troops being annoying down here. Um yes, and we should cut east. I think cut some real lines. Make sure that the uh, the enemy troops do not um, use those lines anymore. I think that would be wise. We'll take this town here. There we go. That worked out, and now we can move down here. Yeah. Okay. Wow, look at that. We can make a a perfect position here, and we will. There we go. Completely cut off. I mean, we can probably take care of this unit now. Yeah, we can. It retreated. As rightly it should. Um... Kind of thinking of doing that next. Now we only have two move. That's our movement points to the right there. <laughs> we have got the option to kick these guys in the nads, and we will. There we are okay. No more movement. That's fine. Can we? Yeah, we can. They held. Okay. Well. Mm hmm. Yes. Okie dokie. Stay on that real line, boys. Still have these guys we can move. I think we should. Let's get in behind him. This, this guy is not cut off. It's going to be an expensive uh, bit of maneuvering to get get them. Um, yeah. Hmm. 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 Uh, that will take all our movement, right? But we do take a port if we do. Sure. There we go. These guys can move. And move him to position here as well. So that's kind of nice. The infantry. We do need the infantry in position there. I guess we'll move them over the river here. Get these guys to uh, move up as well. They've, they're in supply. Which is nice. Um, really. I would. What I. Ideally. What I would like to do. Is get to Tallinn. As, as quickly as possible now. I kind of worried that we will not do that at this point um, yeah we've barely gotten into Riga <laughs> I feel we should secure that flank 
I'm gonna just guard it from this forest, it's fine. Let's see, yeah, I've got that set up now. And let's get you in a position where you can actually supply some troops. Okay, that's the SS unit. You can barely move. It's almost embarrassing. Um Yeah, let's let's get you up here. Could still supply them fairly well. You're in an annoying position there. Let's try and get rid of you. There we are, they're out. It's nice. Good. That helps. Now we could put you sort of in the middle there. There we go. Do you also... No, you do not. You need to get to Riga. Mm. Okay, yeah. Where is your headquarters? It's up there. Okay, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, in that case... Go as far as you can along the river. There we go. We got security units. May get us into trouble. We don't want trouble. Can't even cross the river to Riga there? Wow, okay. What kind of troops do we have in this one? Can we tell? Oh yeah. Panzer II, Panzer 38T, so that's the Czech Panzers, Czech Panzer 4E, Panzer 4C, and support. This is actually quite a good unit, nice motorized vehicle. Armored cars as well, these, these guys are well armored, wow. All up in arms, eh? Hmm. Alright, well, we're moving this son up, up as well, I guess along the coast here. Now these guys are out of supply, but it doesn't matter because we're moving them in. Maneuvering them in, as to say. Take some supplies, but that doesn't matter. Okay, we both pull, we both bo we pull both of them in there. That's that's okay. All right, what about you? Okay, yeah, you need to take position in Riga now. Alright, these guys are now out of supply, we'll fix that by moving them into the forest near Riga. In fact, I'm tempted to say this unit should probably keep the, this one company. And why not take two units and clean this one out? What kind of terrain? They're, they're in a swamp. Yeah, they're dead. <laughs> Look at that. Look at the odds. They held. Wow, they're not dead. What are our losses? Hmm, should have paused it. Okay. Can we still do an attack? No, we cannot. Cannot do an attack. Me. Eh. Eh. Oh well. Sad, but true. Uh, ooh, ooh, we could do that. Those are nice odds. We'll just do this, a, a two-pronged attack against these tanks. Can we coordinate that? Apparently we cannot. He still held. Lost 162 men. Oh, we actually used bombers on him. No vehicles, though. Thank goodness. Yeah, there's a lot of vehicles here. We wrecked a few of them, but... Eh. That didn't do it at all. What about you?
Can you do anything? Mm, you have attack strength 24. He's got 14 defense, if I'm reading this correctly. What did we lose? Oh, he lost two artillery pieces, 142 men. But he's losing tanks slowly. Okay, well, maybe we should just bomb this hex. I don't know. <laughs> it seems like the more logical way of doing things at the moment. Sometimes logical is good. Wait a minute, did we not move the headquarters of that? Yeah, we didn't. Okay. In that case, we will move you up here. There we go. We could still move you up here and have you kick these guys in the swamp, but I don't think we will. I think it's much more important to get up here. You can just chill up here for now. What about you? Yes, you need to move here. Get everyone in your team supplied. What are you part of? That headquarters. Okay, fine. Um, it's swamp. We don't want to get into swamp. Clear is equally bad. But, uh, yeah, we need to prepare for uh, for the crushing of these units, basically. So, yeah, we'll probably just haul up here for now. Wow, okay, we can do... Can we do a combined attack? Is that what we can do here? No, we cannot. That would have been beautiful, but nope. That's only 16 against 15. That's, that's, that's suicide. We're not doing that. Um, okay. What about all of these? You're still in supply. Excellent. Oh, yeah. That's our uh, Army Group North headquarters, of course. Uh, what about if we... I've heard that if you do not select a unit and then add the real uh, info... Can we see the real uh, damage or something? No, maybe. We do not know this. We need to be in real mode for this. Is that what it is? For some reason, this is. I feel it's broken. I'd like to see the real heads, but I can't. Mm, I'm just gonna have to guess it. <laughs> it's kind of stupid, isn't it? Uh, if we don't select anything, and if we do this, and then this, we have to be like really zoomed in, zoomed out. No, that's not it. No, for some reason, it's not showing. This is a problem. Alright, well, the toggle works. Toggle the shift key on. No, I don't think we need to do that. Um, can you tell us? Headquarters unit. No, there's, there's no way. I don't know why it's not working, but apparently it, it is it's not working. Okay. Might be the map mod I installed. I can't remember it working. Okay, let's see. Königsberg, are you still inactive? You are security division. No, I think you're fine where you are now. We've definitely moved our front towards Tallinn. We're, we're, we're crawling up there. Which is bad. We're going to have to find a way through this mess. I don't feel like going through the swamp. But we may have to. Or this forest combined with swamp. 
Are these units activated right now? They are. Oh boy. That's something we're going to do in this video. We're going to have the Finns attack. <laughs> yes, have these Soviets remember us. Uh, I think we'll go for the fortress level things. That will probably do best. Let's see. Oh yeah, it's border regiments, fortified regions. Strength points four. Sure. Let's have the um let's have these guys attack that. Retreated. I love it. And then there's just security units over here. Surrendered, retreated. Good, good, good. Let's scare them a little. I like that. Um, oh, there's probably something there that can't attack. Oh, well, we'll do it with these guys. It's fine. Retreated. Excellent. Yeah, there's holes in your line there, uh, Soviet commander. Sorry. <laughs> Had to do it. Um, but that's about the only thing we can do. We can skirmish a little bit, you know, make them worried. That's our, that's our goal here, make them worried, make them pull troops there. I don't think they feel very threatened at the moment, especially at the impossible level, but, you know, you can try, right? Is this... this Soviet pocket here, yeah, it's still there. Oh, damn it. They've made a fortress here near Helsinki. I don't like that. Speznuts, I guess. Speznuts. Okay, I am going to leave it here. I'm going to send a save to my good friend Agrippa. And we'll have to wait and see what happens next. See you next time. Bye-bye. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you ever so much for watching. Please consider leaving a like and or comment. And please also subscribe if you haven't done so already. Thank you again. Cheers.